Coach, I know you're happy with the win, but with the Celtics making it close, was that uh, speaks to the, the depth as far as the injuries are concerned, or were there some correctable things that an area of growth for you guys? Speaks to how good they are. I mean, you know what's coming. Like, I, you're not beating that team by 30. I don't, you know, you could, but considering we haven't beaten them since, since I've been here, I, th I, th I think uh, it's kind of an apt. You know, I, I also think we played eight guys, and, and that's part of it. I think there was some, some fatigue. Sure, there's, there's, there's things we can get better at. You know, I'm going to talk to our 22-year-old point guard about being a little more, you know, secure with the ball. And, and, uh, uh, but, uh, um, you know, overall, we, we hung on and, and, and closed it out. Other than those miscues that you mentioned from your point guard, he, he, had, a, he had a big night, especially in that in that third quarter. What's, what's been the biggest area of growth that you have seen from D'Angelo? You know, he's, he's, um, there's no fear. You know, there's no fear. He, he believes in himself. He's got tremendous, tremendous confidence. Uh, and he's playing really well right now. I think, you know, I think with guys out, we've given him a little, more, a little bit more of the green light. I think we need it. We need him to uh, uh, be aggressive. Uh, and uh, me and him have talked about it. And, and uh, uh, he was aggressive tonight. We need him to keep, keep doing that. <laughs> Can I ask, uh, uh, in that 29-7 run at the end of the third quarter, when he was so hot, were you guys doing something in particular defensively to kind of feel that, or were they just missing? No, I, th I think we were changing, changing some coverages, giving them some different looks. I, 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 I don't think we could match up with them man to man for, for 48 minutes. Quite honestly, I think uh, uh, we tried to slow them down with some different stuff. Um, you know, I, whether it worked or not, I, I just think overall we were good defensively. I don't, I don't think we were stalwarts uh, uh, offensively by any means. We didn't shoot the ball great. I think we were 41 percent from the field, so our defense, uh, our defense kind of pushed us through, Greg. And a, a couple of the wins that you, bigger wins that you've had, though, I mean, you've outscored people. Uh, in this particular instance, I mean, you had to do it largely, other than D'Angelo, largely on the defensive end. Um, even though, I mean, and Ed didn't even play that many minutes because of the foul trouble. Does that speak to, I guess, how far you guys have come defensively that yeah, I think, can do that? Yeah, no, I think it's a huge confidence booster. And there was, you know, so many guys contributed defense. I thought, uh, you know, Jared Allen was fantastic. I thought just, just overall, his whole game was fantastic. But he's like our goalie back there. You know, he's like our, uh, 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 he, he protects the rim. He's all over the place. We ask him to be in pick and roll defense. We ask him to protect the rim. I just think he was he was monumental. And Rody was, I thought Rody was all over the place. Um, you know, so um, a lot of guys, a lot of guys contributed defensively. Kenny, over here on your right. You guys are basically a playoff team now uh, with the way the Eastern Conference is and with the success you've had in December and January. What's missing from this team to make it a team that can not just be a playoff team, but a team that can make it to the second round of the playoffs? <sighs> that's a, that's a, you know, um, I, I, first of all, I just still think we have a long way to go to, to, to you know, even even uh, uh, um, really uh, talk about the playoffs. I, th I think the schedule is tough, and and uh, um, I'm I'm not talking about it. I'm, I'm we're taking it game by game. Um, you know, to win a playoff series, that's a whole. I think that's a whole nother realm. And I'm not selling our guys short. I just don't think we're there yet. I think we're we're making strides towards towards doing something special here. Uh, but I'm 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 super cautious, and I I just want us our group to stay humble, myself to stay humble, and uh, and understand uh, um, that this we got really kind of lock into each game and, and lock into the nets and getting better and I, I think some good things can happen. Uh, Kenny, back to the defense. Uh, D'Angelo's defense on Rozier who's hurt you in the past might be overlooked by some, you know, because of all the offense that he provided. Is, is his defense as good as it's been under you? I think it's getting, I think it's getting better. I, I really do. I think he's made big strides. I think I think the analytics will, will back that up, that he is uh, <laughs> he is an improved defensive player. And listen, I think he's still got a long way to go. Uh, uh, to be that two-way player, we want to, uh, um, you know, help him, help him be, but um, much improved, much improved defensive player. You, you said you hadn't beaten them since you got here, which I know it's been a couple of years. I don't know if that's actually true or not, <laughs> but... Um, I'm pretty sure it is. <laughs> Congratulations. Now, I mean, when you, I mean, do you see 
any kind of gap when just when you're looking at the film and stuff uh, hey we can do things against them we couldn't do a couple years ago or interesting like <laughs> so I watched you know I watched our last game against them uh, uh, you know in Boston and I know it seemed like a kind of a blowout and but I, I I really thought number one they made a lot of tough shots on us in Boston so I, I, I and and I thought we had a lot of good looks so that gave you know me personally a lot of confidence coming into this like man if we can if we can uh, 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 if they don't make as many tough shots, I think we'll have a chance. So, uh, um, I'm not saying we played great there, but the, it was a lot better than I thought. So, I think that that gave us confidence coming in here tonight, especially at home. Home crowd, crowd was great. Uh, we had a chance at this one. Coach, in, in terms of the team making strides, you know, the playoffs, you said it's something that you're looking at, but it's far away. I know you take it game by game, but how important is the next four weeks in this particular time of the season as you head towards All-Star to sort of keep momentum going the right way? I mean, I will admit this, as, as it keeps going, it becomes more important. Like, you know, we're obviously in a position we've never been in. Uh, um, so um, I think as we get deeper in the season, as we begin to, uh, um, if we continue to make strides, then, then these games are going to take more and more significance. But I think right now what you're talking about is, is uh, uh, we're playing games that mean something. And uh, uh, that's, that's exciting, it's exciting for our crowd, but it's also exciting for our, our development and our confidence uh, listen these guys you know these guys think they can they can do something special and uh, um, you know so far uh, uh, you know we're, ma we're making strides coach you know crab Rondé, Karras, Dudley and you're still in this position right now in training camp did you feel like if your team withstood injuries that you could still be in this position or how you have you been mm -hmm. surprised by the way your team has grown so I think that's the most the you know the thing that pleases me the most is how we've kind of like I, if you would have told me you know we'd be in this position without those guys i would say no way and that's no discredit to anybody i do think we're deeper i keep saying that we we definitely have but missing those you know those as you could argue three starters you know missing those guys and and we're still even a win like tonight it makes it it makes it kind of more special that uh, uh we're doing it with some with, with some really key key players out and, and starters so uh um makes it extra special. Thank you. Thanks, everybody.